Yo, what's up guys, Old School Dan here. And in this video, we're gonna talk about why you should avoid working the trapezius muscle and the obliques. Hit the music. Let's get straight into it. Number one, avoid training the trapezius muscle. Two credible sources I'm gonna list right now. Number one, in Visterana's Wild Physique book, it talks about why you should not work the trape tra trapezius muscle. And in Steve Reed's book, he talks about why you should avoid training the traps. Reason being is because when you train your traps to be big, and once you get big traps, it makes your shoulders look narrow. And another thing, Frank Zane says, if you want to build what they uh, really want to achieve, what they call symmetry, work the peripheral muscles. And the peripheral muscles are like the lats, the forearms, the calves, and the waistline, and so and so. But anyways, he talks about why you shouldn't, um, you know, hit the traps, the chest, the ass, the thighs too hard because that doesn't give you a symmetrical look. It gives you a blocky look. And if you notice this, a lot of the old school bodybuilders and a lot of like the like every classic bodybuilder from the '70s down never had big traps. It wasn't until like they hit the bodybuilders in the 80s and the 90s where they started having the big traps and they got massive huge, like Dorian Yates and guys like that, but they didn't have no traps. Because like I said earlier, it gives you a narrow shoulder look. It does not make you look symmetrical or proportional. I mean, it could, but it just, it makes your shoulders look narrow. The reason is that they want you to build wide shoulders so that it makes your V taper more impressive. All right, moving on to the next muscle. Let's talk about why you shouldn't build your obliques up in both um, Vince Gerana's The Wild Physique book and Steve Reeves' um, Classic Physique book, they both do not say to work the oblique muscle. Reason being is that when you work them and you work them with weights, which is a thing you should never do, it, you become one line. Like you're no longer a V taper, you're just like one line, like a brick wall, it's weird. And not to hate on a lot of the power lifters out there or guys who just like lift for sheer strength and stuff like that. But those guys, when they, when they do a lot of deadlifts and squats, I feel like they build up their obliques so much, they look just like a straight line. Like, it, I don't like it. It's not V-taper, it's not beautiful. It's just like, you're just very basic, I'm sorry. And I sort of get frustrated when I'm at the gym and I see someone doing side bends. I'm like, dude, oh my gosh, why are you doing side bends? You probably don't even know what that does to you. So that was some quick value for you. With that being said, if you found this video useful and you thought it was very valuable information, give this video a like. Subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. Thanks for watching this is Old School Dan checking out. Peace.